Hello and welcome to my first video of 2012. So this is an, a tweak from the Cydia store called Motion and as you can probably see at the moment my icons are going absolutely crazy. So this is a dollar to buy in the app store uh, which I've just done and as you can see it animates your icons on your iPhone. At the moment I've got it all turned on so it's pretty much going crazy at the moment but there are quite a few different effects which we'll go through uh, one by one. Okay, so effect number one is called rotation. So if I just go into the settings and go to motion. So here is rotation. We'll turn that on and we'll go back and we'll see what happens. So as you can see there, the mail icon is starting to rotate. And there you go. There goes Facebook. There goes Maps, which is quite a nice, quite a nice look, I suppose. It's a bit better than just the standard static icons. That's one thing I like about Windows Phone 7 is the sort of animated tiles. Uh, I just wish iOS would do something like that, but this is close enough, so that's rotation. And number two is going to be scale. So again, if we go into the settings, go to motion and go to scale, or scaling, sorry, and if we just have a look and see what that does. There you go, so there goes Safari, so it goes up and then it goes back down. And there goes the camera application, so that's scaling. So the next effect is called skew. So again, go back into the settings and turn on skew. And if we have a look and see what that does. And there it goes, run keeper. You can see that's sort of skewing and there go the other ones now. Which gives you quite a nice effect as well. Okay, and the next effect is called flip. So again, we'll just jump straight over and turn that on. And let's see what happens. And there goes the camera one, so it completely flips all the way around. So does Safari. So as you can see that gives you quite a nice effect. So the next effect is called jump. So again we're going to go back in and we're going to turn on jump. And then see what that does. And there you go, there goes Cydia, there goes email, there goes Tweetbot. They're all starting to like lift off and come back down again. So then the final effect is called transparency. So again go into our settings, turn that on and see what happens. Which one's going to go first? Which one's going to go first? There goes iBooks, there goes videos, there goes mail. And again, that just comes in and out of the alpha transparency. Okay, so we do have some wave options as well for the icons. So if we go into the settings, we've got wave, uh, vertical wave. So that's going to do it vertically. So if we have a quick look at that, there you go. It's starting to wave. That's quite nice, actually. I quite like that one. And if we just go back. And if we turn on the horizontal, and again, that's just going to be horizontal. So again, if we go back, turn that off. So what will happen if we turn these all on? And if we turn these on as well, and we turn the simultaneous one on as well. As it says here, that this doesn't apply to waves, so we'll just leave it like that and see what happens. And there you go. So as you can see, all of the icons are now animating and doing different crazy things. So, like I said earlier, this is a dollar from the Cydia store. So, as usual, guys, thanks for watching, and I'll see you all in the next video.